let's go through how to play the Dinosaur 1 through 5 game. It's the same way we've played it with the other themes, um, but I think it's worth looking at again. Um, and I'm going to move my camera. The one thing I really want to remind you about, I know what I talked about last time, is the language that goes with it. So think about it as a story problem. So I would ask my partner that I'm playing with, and we're going to take turns back and forth um, to close their eyes. And then I would place some dinosaurs in the volcano and some outside the volcano. And so then my question would be, and so again, think about it like a story problem. Um, the question is, how many dinosaurs are roaming outside the volcano? And it's always going to be in five, and I encourage students to use their fingers. So it's always going to be in five, and so we're going to use our index finger and count. One, two, three. Three dinosaurs are roaming outside the volcano. And then I say, okay, if there's three outside, how many dinosaurs are in the volcano? So you can hide three, and then how many are left? And so let's check one, two. Yes, you're correct. And then it's time for the other person to set the board and ask the questions and you would then answer them and go back and forth a few times. I would say at least three, maybe four times back and forth and then have the student make one final board by using a little glue stick on the dinosaurs to turn it into a sticker to make their last board. And then you can go back and, you know, if you've been keeping these, you can go back and do all of them um, just as they're set. Have fun.